are four women in this final, including Kenny Harrison, who have world or Olympic medals. But Kenny is the only one that does not have a gold. Maybe tonight, just maybe, it's Kenny's night. From the Bahamas, this is Devin Charlton. With a medal of any color, Devin Charlton will have the Bahamas' first world medal in this event. Now, the world record holder and meet record holder is Nigeria's Toby Amosar. I want to read you something, because last month, she was provisionally suspended by the Athletics Integrity Unit for missing three drug tests in a 12-month span, but was cleared by a disciplinary tribunal just on August 17. And Toby said this, I am thrilled to put this behind me. I look forward to defending my title at the World Championships. I generally have been and consistently will be an ally of clean sport. Can you imagine if she can come through that Addo and win the world title? It's going to be a lot more difficult than she found it last year. She hasn't had the type of season that indicates that that's possible. But I would not completely count out the Nigerian at all, particularly being in the center of this very hot final. There's Kenny. So let me tell you why it could be Kenny's night. Her coach now is Bobby Percy, and he has had more winners at these world championships in this event than anybody else. Gail Devers has won it three times. Michelle Perry won it twice, and that's before we start talking about Don Harper Nelson and Joanna Hayes, who have a limp. Okay, so I know you. I know you know why I'm here. And especially if you're a Team Jamaica fan, I know you know why we're here right now, right? Yes. <laughs> Do I have to say her name? Do I even have to say her name? Danielle Williams, what an upset she caused. What an upset she caused. Oh my gosh. She took the title away from Nigeria's, uh, what's her name? Amosan? I forgot her first name. Yeah, she um, was the reigning world champion up until today. Daniel Williams of Jamaica, this little girl from Jamaica who no one knew about, who no one heard about, who, well, not that we didn't hear about her, but really, she was like in the background, right? Daniel Williams really caused an upset today in Budapest. What a race it was. What a race, the first gold for Team Jamaica, the first gold medal for Team Jamaica. Well, everyone... Um, was expecting that Shelly would have brought us the arm, would have brought us, yes, and I'm a Jamaican, yes, I'm going to say us, <laughs> would have brought us, but I'm, I'm speaking, this is, this is a channel for everybody, Americans, Jamaicans, British, whoever, so I'm not, I'm not, I'm trying not to, I'm trying not to be as biased, I'm trying to be not biased, you know, I'm, I'm trying to broaden the playing field, but as a Jamaican, I must say, this is the first gold medal for Jamaica, the first one in this world championship. It's just this morning I, I, I saw an article where they said, whoa, no gold for Jamaica. They said, um, where they were looking at the medal standing and um, they were saying um, that um, it, was the, it was a local Jamaican paper called The Gleaner. And they were saying, no, you know, there was no medal for Jamaica. Jamaica failed to be on the top 10 among the medals. In track and field, Jamaica is normally on that top 10 board, that medal tally board. And up until today, um, you know, Jamaica was not on that medal tally board, and so I can say with this gold medal, I'm sure that Jamaica is there right now. So, the 100 meter hurdles with the Jamaican Daniel Williams, the new world champion, the 2023 world champion, Daniel Williams. Let's take a look at this race, guys. Can she get a second world title, or will Camacho Quinn add her Olympic title to this world athletics title? Two women in this race have won it before. Set. Women's 100 meter hurdle final away and the Olympic champ did not get a good start at all. Kenny Harrison did in lane two, Danielle Williams of Jamaica. Here comes Kenny Harrison. Now here comes Jasmine Camacho Quinn. That is close. I think it may have been Williams. I think it's Williams as well. Has Danielle Williams just come and won another gold medal to go along with the one she won eight years ago? They're all looking up at the board. It is she Danielle has. Williams. She has rocked and shocked them, the 30-year-old Jamaican. 
You look at the Jamaican crowd. <laughs> Another shocker. Monday was Shakari. Today's Daniel. You talk about perseverance. There are a lot of people that were beginning to write off oh the world champion from eight years ago as okay, she's been world champion, but this new breed is gonna keep her off of podiums. They're not keeping her off of this podium. She'll be at the top of it with another world title. She did not make it to Tokyo. She finished fourth at trials. She's come to the, this global championship in 2023, and she's a world champion again. That's a pretty big upset. Jasmine Camacho Quinn picked the wrong time to have her only defeat in 2023 thus far in this event. So while everybody else was worried about the middle, and justifiably so, that's where all the folks with recent medals are, but it was the woman who won her world title eight years ago in Beijing that had enough nerve and enough experience. She had a brilliant lean to keep the Olympic champion Jasmine Camacho Quinn off the top of that podium. And that lean is the difference between gold and silver tonight here in Hungary. Look at how close this race is midway through. And look at how far Camacho Quinn came back from. But she's known for that. She can always recover from deficits. She was one hundredth of a second short tonight. And Danielle Williams. Look, number of people who have won two world titles in this event, you can count them on one hand. Gail Devers, she has three. Michelle Perry has two. Sally Pearson has two. That's the list. Now make it Michelle Williams. Danielle Williams, pardon me. How about that? So there have been three Jamaican medals in the last two finals that we've had here tonight. The long jumpers took care of business on the men's side with silver and bronze. And now this woman will take home gold yes. for Jamaica. <laughs> and this is just going to form for these world championships. Surprises everywhere, unbelievable performances everywhere. How close do you like it? Danielle Williams of Jamaica, eight years apart, she's a world champion again. Wow. <laughs> she is a determined. Wow. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Daniel Williams. Who, who the heck was Daniel Williams? Was this her? Was this her? Man. Wow. I mean, this is Jamaica's version of what happened on Monday, what Shakari did on Monday. This is Jamaica's version. Daniel Williams, a new world champion. Not new to track, but new to the world because, I mean, we must have heard about Daniel Williams somewhere down the line, maybe last year. Um, you said she did not qualify for um, for Tokyo, but um, I'm sure she was there in Eugene last year. Um, you know, so we all, you know, I mean, we we heard of, of, about a Daniel Williams, but we have never really know about Daniel Williams up until this moment up until this moment oh my gosh it's really a shocker it is really 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 a shocker really a shocker it's been a long time coming just like Shakari, just like Shakiri just like Shakiri Shakiri has been struggling I mean for, um, for, for most of her career and um, she's shining now. Now we have another one, Daniel Williams, right here. Daniel Williams, she did it. <laughs> she did it, guys. She did it. Oh my word! I'm sure, as I said before, I'm sure all of us was expecting great things to happen from Shelly. We we're expecting great things to happen from Sharika. 
because they shined last year. They, sh they, they really put up, put up a show last year um, in Eugene and we were expecting a repeat of Eugene. You know, it's all about when is your season, your season. When is your season? It is your season. It's, it's your season. And we are so proud of this um, rising star that has now risen, has now risen to the world stage um, in a magnificent manner. Daniel Williams of Jamaica, Crown, congratulations. And congratulations to the others as well. I, um, the Nigerian, the Nigerian um, was the um, the world champions, the world champion up until now, and um, it's now Daniel Williams. So we must say congratulations to everyone who was in that race. I don't need to make this. I don't think I need to make this video any video any longer. You've seen it. We've all seen it. It's sealed, signed, and delivered. Daniel Williams, the new world champion.